The ZB Labs DevOps platform is designed for standardized, enterprise-scale application release automation. In this video, we'll take a look at the fundamentals of the platform's underlying model and how it helps you achieve fast, automated, repeatable deployments. You have software that you need to make available to users. This usually means writing and testing scripts, stopping and starting containers or servers, copying files to various places, and hoping you haven't forgotten anything. Not really a big deal when you're deploying one application to one or two VMs or servers. But imagine that instead of one app, you have 10, and instead of two servers, you have 100. And something fails halfway through, but your rollback scripts don't work because they were written to roll back a whole deployment, not a partial one. Oh, and this is your production environment, and your customers can't access your website while you're deploying. Then it's easy to see how important it is to do deployment right. And that's what the Zebia Labs DevOps platform is designed to do. It makes deployments fast, easy, repeatable, and error-free. But it's not just a platform that can run scripts and copy files for you. Zebia Labs is different because it's based on something called the Unified Deployment Model, or UDM. UDM has three core concepts, packages, environments, and deployments. A package describes everything that needs to be provisioned, deployed, installed, restarted, or run to get an application into an environment. The items in the package are called deployables because they're the things that can be deployed to your infrastructure. Deployables can be physical files, also known as artifacts, as well as specifications for configuring containers, cloud instances, virtual machines, or middleware. An environment is a logical grouping of the parts of your infrastructure where you want to deploy applications. Typically, you would set up environments such as development, test, and production. An environment contains things like container platforms, cloud providers, virtual hosts, servers, clusters, and databases. You can add any combination of infrastructure items to an environment. Unlike a provisioning tool that configures a single machine at a time, ZB Labs can target many different machines and endpoints. Packages are environment independent. That is, you should be able to deploy the same application to every environment in your pipeline, from development all the way through to production. The final core concept of UDM is the main event, deployment. This is the process of configuring and installing a package in a specific environment. Deployment starts with automatic mapping of the deployables in the package to the targets in the environment. The combination of a deployable and a target produces a deployed item, or deployed for short. This is the artifact or resource as it will be configured for the selected environment. The mapping of deployables to targets also generates a plan made up of the steps that will be executed during deployment. The time required to generate the deployment plan is called the planning phase. It's important to understand the planning phase because this is the point at which you can customize the platform's behavior. For example, you might want to use a feature of your container orchestration platform that isn't supported out of the box, or deploy to a target technology that there isn't a plugin for. Or you might just want to change the way the plan is generated by adjusting steps or adding your own. To do this, you provide custom rules that the platform will follow while it builds the plan during the planning phase. There's no need for you to manually add a step every time you want to deploy. You can deploy the way your business requires, or even deploy to targets that aren't supported by default, and still benefit from the unified deployment model and achieve repeatable, automatable deployments. But the CBA Labs DevOps platform doesn't just build a plan to deploy your application. It also automatically generates a rollback plan that will return your infrastructure to its previous state. Just like with deployment plans, you don't need to manually create the necessary rollback steps. At this point, you've probably noticed that some of the Zebia Labs DevOps platform's major selling points are actually things you don't do. You don't have to specify which deployables go to which targets, you don't have to build the deployment plan step by step, and you don't even have to think about how to roll back if the deployment fails. Zebia Labs takes care of all of that time-consuming, error-prone manual work for you, so you can focus on what you're deploying. You can start seeing these benefits today. Visit cblabs.com to try the DevOps platform for free.